Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What is going on, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. So, yes, as you can see, I am back for another video. And as you can tell by the title, it's another wash and go. But before we even get into any of that, I need you to go and take care of the preliminary things that you always should do if you're new when you come to the channel or if you haven't done them and you're still coming back to watch. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel, like this video. And then if you want to... You need to, but if you want to, follow me on my social medias, on my TikTok and on my Instagram. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. So, as you can see, we're doing a hair video today. And, yeah, uh, my hair is freshly washed and clean. So, today I'm going to be using the Perfect Texture Curl Cream by Nature Lab Tokyo. Yeah, mm-hmm. Something new, a little different. So, this is what this is looking like right here, okay? And to go over that, you already know what I'm about to say. And when I say it, you're going to be mad. Extreme gel. I know. I know. I know y'all are tired of seeing it. But the hair store, I think I already told y'all this. But anyway, the hair store that I keep going to, I went back four times. And they don't know when they're going to have the other gel back in. So they have to find a new gel. And that's not the same. I need something... Anyway, that's a lot to go over. So yeah, um, yeah, as you can see, my hair is freshly washed and everything. I'm gonna go off camera, part my hair, and then I'm gonna come back, and that way we can get started. Tip, tip, tip on hardwood floors. Ten, ten, ten across the board. Give me face, 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 y'all. Face card never declines, my God. Eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it. Okay, so now that I have my hair parted, we're gonna jump right into this. So I was at Ulta. And I found this product, along with two or three other products that I'm going to try out again. Let me get you to look at it, okay? So, yeah, um, I was skeptical at first because it looks gray. And I thought I don't want it to dye my hair. I just want it to be a styling cream. But what I did was I did open it already just the way I could squeeze it and see what was going on, you know? And so it has a light bit of tint to it, color-wise. I don't know if y'all can see that, Okay. But, I mean, it smells decent. It smells like lotion. Kind of. Okay. So, I squeezed a small amount into my hand. So, I'm going to just rub this. Okay. Oh, wrong side. And I'm going to just apply this to the hair. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to work it in there. I didn't give it a little spritz of water. Let's see if I can give it a little spritz of water. Okay. Now it is a little looser than I thought. Like it's thick, but it's loose. Like a good like a good in-between. Okay. And just make sure you're hitting from root to tip. Okay. And I'm trying my best to get the product in there. I might have put too much. That's probably what it is. I just hope this stuff doesn't tie my hair. Because that's what I do not want to happen. But I don't think it is. Okay. So, I'm going to go on with the extreme gel. You've already seen this. But, okay, let's do this. Maybe that's enough. Okay, let's close that up. Okay. And we're going to just directly apply this into the hair. So how's everybody been doing? Okay? Because I've been well, you know, getting things together. Just trying to get my life in order, you know. And I want to end the year on a good note. So I've just been making lifestyle changes and clearing my mental health and living you know staying on the low key as i usually do and stay out the way because that's not who i am to be in the way that's not who i am and if that's who you are then that's who you are but that's not who i am okay i'm going to add a little more gel just a little bit more gel okay and i want to make sure i get this back section too make sure you're getting the back section nooks and crannies, anywhere where you usually may forget 
or where the product doesn't get in as good, okay? And I'm just running my fingers through it over and over again. But as you can see, my fingers are running smooth, so it has good slip. You know? Okay. Alright. So that's pretty much it for that first section, so we're going to move to the second one. Okay. Beepity-boppity-boop. I'm gonna go with some more of this product. Oh. And it's gotten a little cooler. Like a lot cooler. It's not blazing hot like it was. I'm just so ready for the winter to get here. Like fall is good. And really I don't really want them. Well, I like the fall and the winter. Because, well anyway, I'm just waiting on October to get here. That we can get a little colder, a little cooler, you know. And not only that, the fall exposes a lot. The fall and winter expose a lot. You know, the, I, for me personally, the fall and winter exposes who can really dress. You know, the ones who don't like to dress or can't dress will throw on, you know, the same sweatsuits and sweatpants and different things like that. And the ones who can't dress will have nice little outfits and combinations and different things like that to wear. Now, what category do I fall in? I don't know. Because I'm quick to throw on a nice little workout pant, you know, or have, you know, jeans and different types of pants I can wear, but I tell you what, I better not see those Adidas pants, okay? Those are out of uh, style anyway. Who's wearing those? I mean, come on now. You should not be wearing those every day. Those should not be cycling through every winter as your main resource, okay? And if they are, you should be wearing those maybe once or twice a month, okay? So I'm just getting this product in here. I'm working it in. All right, and I'm going in with some more gel. Oh. You know, if you got to go buy some clothes, to prepare, buy some clothes. But while we're talking about clothes, do you know anybody who sells, like, good turtlenecks, like, mock turtlenecks? Because I've been searching online, and I haven't really found anything. And Amazon, hmm, sometimes they have good stuff, and sometimes they don't. And I can't get nothing from Shein, for obvious reasons. And I've never bought anything from there anyway, so I wouldn't even try that. And Fashion Nova doesn't sell any, like, turtlenecks or anything like that or mock turtlenecks. They need to get that in their catalog. So, yeah. Okay. So, I'm just working this product in here. So, I'm just going to move to this third section now. Okay. And have y'all been seeing the movies that are about to come out? The Woman King with Viola, da Viola Davis. You know, Black Panther comes out later on this year, close to the end of the year, I think. And the controversial viral, backlash receiving, culture shifting, Little Mermaid trailer, you know? Yeah, yeah, that, mm, I don't know, I've been saying, yeah, that's been a lot for these past couple days. You know, there's a whole lot of things I don't understand. And part of the, one of the things that I don't understand is how people can be in such outrage over a fictional character that just so happens to be recasted as a different color, race, okay? You know, I, I think that's really crazy, you know? And it kind of shows still that we have not progressed that far. And even if we have progressed that far, there are a lot of people that remain that are still, well, you know, I, I, I don't have to say it to say it, but you know what I'm trying to say, okay? So, yeah, that's pretty much what it is. So, I'm just putting this in this third section right here. Running it through and running it down, okay? And have y'all been watching the mukbangs? Y'all need to go back and watch the mukbangs, okay? Go back and watch the mukbangs. You know, everybody loves to eat. You know, y'all need to go back and watch those tenders I made, the Honey Hot Tenders, Okay? Because nobody really tuned into that. And that's been a couple weeks, at least to a month. So, yeah, y'all really need to go back and watch that video. Okay. But again, I'm just running this product through. Okay. So, at this point, what I'm going to do is add in some more gel.
Okay. I just want to make sure I'm getting it all the way through. Because I love my definition. You know, I want the washing to go to last four or five days, six days. Even though, hopefully, you know, I want to get back on track and be washing my hair every three to four days. So they're not lasting a week. But sometimes if it's a real good wash and go, I'll wait a week. If I'm not uploading two weeks. But that's besides the point. Okay. So I'm just running this through. And I'm just really working that product in the hair. Okay. <laughs> okay, so now what I'm going to do at this point, now that I've talked to do the first three sections, I'm going to go off camera, finish this last section, and then when I come back, I'm going to show you the final results and how everything turned out, and then give you my final thoughts on everything. Okay, y'all, so I am back with the final result, and so this is what the hair is looking like. Okay, let's get into it. You can see some of them curls in there. Okay. All right, so um, we're going to just go to the bureau, though, where you can see how everything is going. So, yeah, um... I'll admit, it did better than I thought. However, it did not meet the expectation that I had before I used the product. See, in my mind, I thought it was going to be like, the bomb. But no, it's okay. Like, you can still see definition there. You can see that it's going to last. You can see that it did what it was supposed to do. However, I don't think it was thick enough. For the hold for my hair, because I know how my hair is, it needs hold and weight to it. So, yeah, but other than that, I mean, it did pretty good. It smelled good. It had good slip. You know, it moisturized the hair. My hair doesn't feel dry. There is no crunch layer. It has movement, as you can see, so it's not stiff. And there is definition in there, as I said before. So, I mean, overall, uh, give me one second. Okay, so, yeah, I think overall, hmm, here's what I'll do. Okay, here is exactly what I'll do. Mmm, mmm, yeah. Mmm. I'll give it a 7.8 out of 10. Okay, so for slip, I gave it an 8. For definition, I gave it an 8. For smell, I gave it a 7. And so a 7.8 out of 10. I think that that is going to be the best score. Okay, that's just what it is. And yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video and any other videos that I have on my channel, subscribe to the channel, like this video, share this video, follow me on my social media accounts and everything like that. And I'll see y'all in the next bit of content.